Colocasia sclenta is a tropical plant grown primarily for its edible corms, the root vegetables most commonly known as taro. It is believed to be one of the earliest cultivated plants. Linnaeus originally described two species which are now known as Colocasia sclenta and Colocasia antiquorum of the cultivated plants that are known by many names including Edos, Dasheen, Taro, but many later botanists consider them all to be members of a single, very variable species, the correct name for which is Colocasia sclenta. Names, this plant and its root is generally called Taro, but it has different names in different countries like for instance Edo. In the Philippines, it is usually called Garbi, Abi or Ravi. Description, rhizomes of different shapes and sizes. Leaves up to 40 a, 24.8 cm, sprouts from rhizome, dark green above and light green beneath, triangular ovate, sub-rounded and magnate at apex, tip of the basal lobes rounded or sub-rounded. Petial 0.8-1.2 m high. Spathe up to 25 cm long. Spadex about three-fifths as long as the spathe, flowering parts up to 8 mm in diameter. Female portion at the fertile ovaries intermixed with sterile white ones. Neuters above the females, rhomboid or irregular oblong. Male portion above the neuter. Synandrium lobed, cells 6 or 8. Appendage shorter than the male portion. Taxonomy. The specific epithet, esclenta, means edible in Latin. Taro is related to xanthosoma and caladium, plants commonly grown as ornamentals, and like them it is sometimes loosely called elephant ear. Distribution and habitat, Taro was probably first native to the lowland wetlands of Malaysia. Estimates are that Taro was in cultivation in wet tropical India before 5000 BC, presumably coming from Malaysia and from India further transported westward to ancient Egypt, where it was described by Greek and Roman historians as an important crop. In India, it is known as Gadari, with smaller ones called Abi, or Avi being more common and popular. In Indonesia, it is called Talas or Keladi. In Australia, Colocasia sclenta var aquatilis is native to the Kimberley region of Western Australia. Variety sclenta is naturalized in Western Australia, the Northern Territory, Queensland and New South Wales. In Turkey, Colocasia sclenta is locally known as Gar Paragraph Leves, and mainly grown in Mediterranean coast, such as Ilanya which is a district of Antalya. In the southeastern USA, this plant is recognized as an invasive species. Uses Taro's primary use is the consumption of its edible corm and leaves. In its raw form, the plant is toxic due to the presence of calcium oxalate, and the presence of needle-shaped rafids in the plant cells. However, the toxin can be minimized and the tuber rendered palatable by cooking, or by steeping in cold water overnight. Corms of the small round variety are peeled and boiled, sold either frozen, bagged in its own liquids, or canned. The leaves are rich in vitamins and minerals. It is also sold as an ornamental aquatic plant. It is also used for anthocyan in study experiments especially with reference to abaxial and adaxial antoceanic concentration. See also, taro, aquatic plants. References External links, Colocasia sclenta in West African Plants A Euro A Photo Guide